Good morning, traders from United World Capital and Cyprus. Yesterday was a much better day than expected. And what a difference a day in the market could do. Citigroup, uh, one of the big uh, American banks, came in with a much better result than the markets had feared. And then, as well, a couple of the other big banks which are going to present results later this week, Goldman Sachs and Bank of America, uh, jumped 3.5% in the United States yesterday, which also had a very positive effect on both the Dow Jones and Nasdaq. This morning, uh, the uh, uh, good uh, sentiment from the United States has been followed up by uh, markets all over Asia, which uh, in average is up around 0.5%. The good results and the uh, change in attitudes in the American market has also had a very big uh, and positive uh, impact on uh, the currency market where the euro in the morning is up to 129.65 very rapidly going close to 130 on bigger risk appetite. It's also, also worthwhile noted, noting that the uh, yield, the bond yield uh, on Greek bonds uh, were at uh, 1765 yesterday. That is the lowest level we have seen since uh, uh, August 2011 and a clear indication that uh, the investors know not any longer are, are gambling on a Greek retreat from the euro. Also, the commodity prices are much better this morning. Copper is up and also gold prices, which reached uh, a one-month low during yesterday's trade, is up to 17.37. Silver is also stronger with, uh, with 32.98. Uh, oil prices uh, continue to raise. Brent crude is... Uh, uh, past 115 yesterday and is keeping steady on this level closer to 116. That has again to do with fears about the development in the situation in the Middle East. I suspect that we are going to have a very uh, interesting new trading day both in currencies and commodities and also the stock markets during the day. I wish uh, you traders a very good trading day from United World Capital and Cyprus.